Hey folks, it's Grimwit. Before we get started, um, I got an apology for the audio quality for this and the next episode, and you'll understand why here in a second. Okay, um, I'm going to tell you what happened, and I'm going to show you in case you also use Fraps, so this doesn't happen to you. Okay, first off, this is Fraps. If anybody hasn't seen it, this is what I use to record my gameplay. Now over here in the movie settings, there's this little option that says record external input. Normally, this is what I use to record my mic. No problem. But, whenever I record Best Friends Forever, I instead use a stereo mix because I don't have my headphones plugged in, so I don't risk talking over the gameplay and I can do a post. Unfortunately, stereo mix just means whatever's coming out of the speakers anyway. So while it's recording the game footage, it's also recording the sound twice over each other. What I should have done was uncheck the goddamn checkbox. If you use Fraps, and you will wonder why the sound is all funky, this is it. Okay, with that done, let's get started. Hey folks, it's Grimwit from Natchevil, and we're playing this again. Alright, first thing we need to do is get back on good terms with Emily. Uh, I guess the first thing is just to ask how she is, and, well, you know, friendship. I'll be honest, I don't know how to increase friendship. Waiting, 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 waiting. Okay, good, she still is talking to us. Awesome. Let's... Oh, perfect. Uh, Alright. Alright. Girlfriend, we are gonna go and get, I don't know, like a gelato or something. Now, all we need to find out is where she is. There we go. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Awesome. Why? Who chills at a school? Okay. Well, finding her shouldn't be too difficult. We just have our... Wait, wait, wait. Turn right around, Liz. I've noticed people walking into this room. What is this room? Principal. Why are people waiting to get in there? Alright, ah, Emily. Emily, Emily, talk to me. Talk to me. <laughs> Emily, don't blank me again. I don't understand why you can't access your friends in this game. There there are three friends, I think. Maybe maybe more. I don't know. I haven't played it that much. Uh Who's this? I don't remember your name. I'm gonna call you not Emily. Emily, Emily, chat. Uh. Hey, I'm doing a project for class about animals and their owners. Do you have any pets? I own a kitten raping quokka. I do. I have a dog, two cats, a parakeet, my dad has an iguana. My mom has a poodle. Isn't a poodle a dog? Please. Calling a poodle a dog is like saying Eugene Moss is a ladies' man. Good point. What does that even mean? Okay. I've thought of a good way to make up with Petey as well. Let's play the drums for him. Awesome. Check my skills. Just like I did on The Sims. Only less energetic. Alright, I don't know if this increases PD rating or whatever, but there is a mini game for drumming, and it's kind of like playing One Finger Death Punch. Only dumber. Now, obviously, this drumming action is way too exciting, so I think I'd slow it down a little bit by reading you a little bit about the Eidos relationship and reported cancellation of Best Friends Forever. This has been touched on in the original Let's Play, but if you're just watching my YouTube channel for some reason, here's what Wikipedia says. 
Originally developed for Eidos Interactive, High School Dreams Best Friends Forever was dropped by the publisher when they merged with Square Enix, and the title was funded by DR Studios themselves until it could be released. Due to this unusual turn of events, many sites, such as IGN, erroneously listed High School Dreams Best Friends Forever as a cancelled project. Due to rumors of this game's demise and the reliance of digital distributions, mainstream media has been slow to acknowledge High School Dreams Best Friends Forever, but customer reviews has been positive, and the game is enjoying an average review score of 4.5 out of 5, even in September 2010. Most of you intrepid people who want to check out the official website for Best Friends Forever on DR Studios' website will have an interesting time finding it because they are so proud of this game that they've decided to completely wipe it off of their website, which is a little bit hilarious, but also makes this the most hipster bad game I've ever played. And I think you should play it too. You can find a copy at Green Man Gaming. You're back! I thought I'd scared you off. Petey, there is very little you can do that will get us not to chase you down like a crazy stalker. Everyone says you're the best DJ they've ever heard. You believe everything you hear? No. Then why are you worried about it? I don't... I'm not worried. You're hot. I'm not worried. I'm curious. I promise I'll be completely honest about what I think. You won't have to worry about that. Because I can't let you hear it. Are we still talking about your play? I was talking about your penis. <laughs> oh god, I'm going to jail for that, aren't I? Um... So how long have you and that girl been going out? I don't have a girlfriend. I don't know what you heard. Then who's Izzy? Izzy? That's my road dog. Your road dog? Yeah, my dog. She gets me. I get her. That's how we get down. Like that word we learned in English last week. Strictly full time. Wet. How is that possible? Girls and guys can't be just friends. It's impossible. Obviously not. Why are you so concerned about me and Izzy? I see we're friends and that's it. I... I don't... Does she think that? You know what? I'm not gonna worry about it. I just want you to trust me, Petey. I do too. And I hope I don't regret this. Regret what? What... What are you doing? What... Oh my god. What's this? My mix. Let me know what you think when you're done. Ah, error. Error cannot compute shit. Error comes to... Ah. <laughs> so I was walking around, and oh, look. A fridge magnet next to this emo git. Is that a thing? Emo git? Anyway, I think it's time to talk to Izzy, the other part of this three-way equation. Cool. Good luck. Now this is just friendly competition. I don't hold anything against Izzy just because she's best friends with the guy I'm stalking. Or trying to get on with. Stalk. Stalk. I'm stalking. And, you know, I'm, I'm not bitter about her knowing him longer than I do. I don't hold anything against her. I'm not shallow like that. Not at all shallow like that. That was great! So, anyway, that's a thing that happened. Um, I don't... Okay, Benny. Talk to me, Benny. What are you doing? Hey, Benny. Working on anything special? Depends. You offering to help? Nah, I do... Let's not get too friendly. Does it involve being mean to anyone? No one that doesn't deserve it. I think I'll pass, just in case we have differing opinions. Yeah, so this is the park. I need to waste time. Um, mostly for the rest of the day, so I figured I'd come to the park. Oh, wait. Checkpoint. Ew. So I am going to show you guys the magnificent maze, or as I call it, how to waste a day. Um, way over here, if I can get the camera finagled right, there's an actual map to maybe the maze. I think that's actually a map. Seriously. To 
Well, you'll just see it. In any case... Let's see here... There we go, contacts. Just to give us something to do, let's try and raise awareness with Olivia. Um, how are you? There we go. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Ooh, checkpoint. And later. Wow, Olivia's taking her sweet ass time. There we go. Okay, she says she's bored. That's a fairly common problem amongst uh, Charm Spring High. Checkpoint. So, hmm. Anyway, this, uh. This is a. This is just a waste of time. Ooh, checkpoint. What's great about this waste of time is how buggy it is. I I'll, I'll show you here in a second. Checkpoint. Uh, this is honestly where all the checkpoints are in this maze. Um, I just... I'm not sure why there's no... There's no cheese. Ah! There's a checkpoint. Let's see if we can get this checkpoint through the wall. Yes, we can. And, oh my god, Lizzie. Lizzie, what what are you doing, Lizzie? <laughs> Premium programming ability. <laughs> there we go, saving. <laughs> this is, um... This is the maze. Yep. <laughs> I'm not too worried about it. Today isn't a school day. Or wasn't a school day. Was it a school day? Crap. I played this like last week while I was recording, so I actually don't remember most of this. <sighs> Very exciting. Ooh, another checkpoint. Let's grab that through the wall. Yes, sir! Excitement and wonder. Hmm. Something to fill time. Something to fill time. I have a Bleeding Edge doll card here from Begoths.com that was purchased in 2005 for Malice Looming in Wonderland. She has a Turtle Wax and a Dog Sad. Her favorite color is blue-black. Is blue-black a color? I guess it is. How much time do I got? I still gotta waste time. She likes pets, turtle wax, doll salad. What the? You just said everything else and everyone else still sucks. I guess her greatest likes is her dislikes. Her dislikes is just about everything. Is this over yet? No, no. It's still running through the maze. Um... Loudmouth head chopping queens, yeah. Watching, we watch wearing rabbits, sneaky striped. Am I? Oh, hey, I made it to the middle. Ha <laughs> ha! Excitement and wonder. There's no cheese, motherfucker. There's no cheese. At least we can sit. Yep. Time to get the hell out of here. Yes, 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 yes. We're going to do this. We are totally going to do this. I even re-recorded it to fix the sound. You're going to love my tracks. Oh, I know I'm going to love your tracks. I don't know why you're here. Get the fuck out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Go, 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 go. Ah, let's listen to beautiful music, Petey. <laughs> I, I really have too much fun with this. Okay, so here's what happened. Um... Yes, I turned the music up, but the sound is still horrible. So I went back and I re-listened and re-danced this. Now, don't worry too much about the outside or my statue of Emily floating there in the right. Here's Petey's track.
like that? Huh. I didn't beat my old score. Oh well. Well, time to go back to the past. And I'm checking my objectives. Everything looks cool. What? Why did it set off just then? Oh well. Um, ooh, we got a phone call. I mean, a message. Oh, I, you are just in time, Petey. Um, okay, we we got to tell him that that was awesome because whether or not it was, it was done by him, and he's awesome. I think that's that's ultimately it's the fro really. Can we compliment him on this fro? I guess not. Anyway. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Okay. Uh, uh, oh my god. Yes, do it, do it, do it, do it. No, cool. See you then. <laughs> I got a date. I got a motherfucking date. And it's... No, not this week. Ah, there it is. Oh my god. Guys, I'm so excited! <laughs> we have two days to waste. Two days. Of course, you realize this also means that I'm gonna have to go and shop for clothes. Do, right? I had a dream the other night about a poisonous snake. It was all coiled up and one of my friends told it to bite me. I... <laughs> what the fuck is this guy's face? Holy shit. <laughs> um... I heard that it means that you're being forced to do something that you don't want to do. Like maybe your parents? Ah. Like my homework? Could be. We just had an argument about it last night. They say I'm not doing enough of it. I tell them that five minutes a night should be fine. Right. Right. I'm just going to let you kids know now if you're watching this and you're a teenager. Homework isn't really all that important. Let's see. I'm just checking my calendar here. And basically, it's exactly what it is. I'm checking to see how many days I have to waste before the big date. I had a dream the other night about a poisonous snake. He was all coiled up and one of my friends told it to bite me. What are the odds of two people having this dream? Well, according to the Navajo Indians, they felt that if you dream of a serpent, you must immediately drop your backpack and run around like a crazy man or you would become paralyzed. The Navajo Indians wore backpacks? Duh, they invented them. Okay, I'll give it a shot. Give what a shot? The backpacks? I don't actually know if the Navajos invented backpacks, but I know they put their kids on their backs, which I think everybody should do. Or was that Cherokee? Hey, what's up, not Emily? <laughs> we, we've got a couple of errands to run. Specifically, this guy over here, which I just remembered I have his, um, I have his leather case. I am now checking my inventory. And, yep, yep, there it is. Leather camera case. Alright, let's go ahead and give this to this guy and score points? Excuse me, but you look like something's wrong. Oh, man, I dropped my sister's new camera case in the sea. She's gonna kill me. At least it was just the case, not the camera. I'm sure she'll understand. It was an accident. No, she won't. It was the third one of hers I'm lost. You have to help can you bring me another one? Too many drugs, dude. Alright, I'll see what I can do. Thanks. You're a lifesaver. I am a piece of candy. Hi, I got you another camera case. How did you manage to lose three of these? Yep, inventory. I can't thank you enough. These things are so easy to lose. I've never lost one. You should be more careful, you know. Just in case. Just in case of what? Just in case of what? Hey, I got a message. From Emily. Oh, yeah. I, sure. I got your back. We need to score points with Emily. Get her talking to us again. I think. 
I'm not real sure what the point of that quest was. Yes, yes, you already told us this. Why is that a thing? Alright. Hey, I'm doing a project for class about animals and their owners. Do you have any pets? <laughs> no! Loading. Sorry, I don't have any time to help you out. How about later? Sorry. I'll be busy then, too. I don't even know who you are, woman. Get out of my face. Uh, speaking of quests, here's another quest we need to... Done! Here's your survey! Interesting. These are some very good answers. Who did you interview? Sorry, I'm sworn to secrecy. A person of honor, as am I. So here's the money we agreed on. It's been about a week since I played the game. I don't remember the money that you agreed on. But hey, money is money. Uh, and another quest filled. Hooray! Ooh. Uh. <laughs> I always get the feeling that Emily is actually working... How can I help you? ...for the shops and businesses in Charm Springs. It just feels that way. She always seems to know when the best deals are. Just, no, 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 we're collecting clothes. What? No, C cancel out of that, Liz. What are you doing? All right, there we go. I'm here to pick up an item. Of course. It's right over there. Thanks. Have a nice day. Now, there's frugal shoppers. There's even couponers. And then there's people like Emily who seem to See know soon. when all the sales are on. And I... I suspect that she's she's part of it. Possibly even in control of it. Let's send her a little message. We know you control the sales, Emily. Or in her language, how are you? Waiting, waiting, waiting. Ah, here we go. Help you. you can start by hair gel. I would like to buy a gelato, please. Of course. Please choose your gelato. I love gelato. It reminds me of Florence in the summer. There you go. Enjoy it. Yes. Eat it. Eat it all. <laughs> okay, so, um... Ooh, checkpoint. It is time to get into the last level of rollerblading. And we've seen how easy the first two are, so this should be a breeze, right? It it surely is. With the best music in the land. Welcome to my boxy nightmare. There is... <laughs> there is no way you can win this. Just to let you know. Because <laughs> the boxes stun you for a long time. I... I don't... I don't even know how I'm supposed to do this without, I guess, tons of practice. But who's got time for that? Ain't nobody got time for that. Oh, so far, so good. Hard coin, hard coin. Avoid the skulls, jump over the boxes. Everything is very Mario here. The stars, you, you cannot oops, you cannot get through this uh, this last medal without the stars. And <laughs> whoops. <laughs> and why wouldn't you why wouldn't you want to go through this mini game and get I I don't know. Well that there goes those points. At least I got the star. I'm guessing, I'm hoping I get the helmet, but I'm not real sure. I, I did watch a Let's Play of this, and it was a fairly complete Let's Play of this. The reason why I even did this particular run. But I don't remember what clothes they got for beating this minigame. Uh, whoops. You gotta hear me say whoops a lot. Yes, damn skulls. We 
got some good music, whoops, uh, while we're crashing into boxes, and I'm frankly surprised that the boxes don't stop her momentum, but uh, Lizzie's a tough girl, she'll just tank through it, whoops. Uh, that, that, that'll come out in the wash, I'm sure. <laughs> like, like the rest of my love. Um... Yeah, I, I don't do so great. Not this time around. Oh my god, skulls! Okay, that, that wasn't too bad. <laughs> uh, I got nothing. I'm out of stuff to talk about. Whoops. There's... I guess I could start naming states. Nebraska, North Dakota. Are we done? Yay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, that was terrible in every way and imaginable. I'm I'm just gonna wrap this up for you guys. Uh loading. Oh yes, I I'm two hundred points shy. I'll I'll see you guys next episode. Where we'll go on a date. <laughs>